해주세요. Plastic in the continuous decarbonization furnace to make a biochar charcoal. Continuously carbonization furnace. Liquid gas preheating. This is liquid liquid gas motor and gas effort to promote continuously supply the liquid gas for the burners. Liquid gas burners. And it can also use natural gas. Ignited by the electric void. We use the preheating one to two hours maximum. After the inner temperature reaches 300 centigrade, we can start feeding the materials. And then the materials will start carbonization and produce the flame gas from the furnace. We can monitor the temperature and also adjust the frequency in, on this controller. This is the temperature of the furnace here. This is the temperature at the this feeding conveyor of the whole system. And this is a double drum furnace. So it's with spray uh, drying process of the inner drum and then to the outer drum the carbonization so it's fitting at this position and this charge at here the smoke coming out from this position and then going to the secondary pyrolysis reactor then return to the furnace bottom burning After burnt heat will come out from the top and then we use this condenser to treat it. If you have the dryer equipment or boiler, we can bring the extra heat after burnt gas from here and then to the other equipment. This furnace is designed for different wide range biomass materials to make biota and charcoal for different uh, carbonization temperature. The size of the drum and the feeding and discharging conveyor the system is able to customize based on customers raw material and uh, discharge capacity. The cooling discharge conveyor is supplied by the cold water. So after discharge, the temperature will be approximately 40 centigrade. We have 
different solution based on different size and moisture for the raw material. So all the crusher dryer is in our range. Don't hesitate to contact him for solution, quotation and all details. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye.